This is the highest village in Scotland, and it has the sign to prove it. Peter has lived here all of his life. And obviously recently there's, as usual, there's been the, the talk about the highest village. It, for me, it'd be a bit strange to find out that we weren't the highest village anymore. I've, I've been told all my life. And Ruth has retired here for the quiet life. If people don't know where One Lock Head is, you say, we're the highest village in Scotland, generally they'll say, well, I thought that was in the Highlands. Mm -hmm. So it's a talking point and it gives people an interest to perhaps look at where it is and come and visit. A battle is brewing between this place and the neighbouring community. But the Ordnance Survey says the one way to measure altitude is to take the doorstep of the highest house, and that's right here in Wanlock Head, at 444 metres above sea level. Along the winding road and over the hill is Lead Hills. Some people here are convinced they should have the title instead. Cameron. Hello, hello, nice to meet you. Nice to meet Come you. On in. Thank you. The measurement of which village is the highest, um, as far as I can see, has been going back 120 years at least, and it's fluctuated. Some sources tell you Lead Hills is the highest village, other sources tell you Wanlock Head is the highest village. Who's going to be building the house to outdo Wanlock Head? That... <laughs> I think the tenders are out, it only has to be 45 feet, so when you get to the high parts on the outskirts of Lead Hills, there's plenty of land and I think somebody will be applying for planning permission before long. We've got names for them and they've got names for us. What uh, are the names? Probably not in camera. <laughs> so as we've been finding out today, people in both villages want the bragging rights. It's a bit of a sibling rivalry, but for now, at least according to the officials, Wanlock Head is the winner. Connor Gillis, BBC News.